reports I heard earlier in the day. The commute wasn't too bad, indicating some people may have stayed home on Friday. But you can rest assured that later in the day, there will be plenty of cars out here and the gas will be expensive. Price wanted to drive to Las Vegas this weekend with his wife, but they changed their minds when this started happening. Gas prices a good 11 cents over what they used to be. With these gas prices, hey, <laughs> all I'd be able to do is just to get there and come back, you know. You can play. No. Believe it or not, though, price is the exception to the rule. AAA says 30 million people are going to be traveling this weekend, and gas prices are not changing many plans. If you do the calculations, it's not that much more to a travel budget. Say if you're driving from Los Angeles to Las Vegas, um, the difference in gasoline prices will make about $6 in, in difference to your budget. And so overall, it's not a significant impact. Mark Anderson told us Vegas is still an option for him this weekend, but on the other hand, he's not affected because his parents are picking up the tab. I don't like it too much, but I'm not really paying the bill, so... If you want to make up some of the dollars you'll lose filling up the tank, AAA is offering these tips. Use air conditioning sparingly and make sure your tires are properly inflated. An efficient car means better mileage. A tune-up is also a good idea. Incidentally, if you're expecting the prices to go down anytime soon, the Department of Transportation predicts it won't happen until after the 4th of July. Reporting live from Los Angeles, Gordon Tokubatsu, Channel 4 News. Now back to you in Burbank. All right, Gordon, thank you. The